Hi there, today I'm going to show you how to transfer your music files from one computer to another using iTunes home sharing feature. Now this is just going to transfer your actual files and I imagine for some of you your playlists and your song ratings other data are going to be important as well so I'll provide some information in the description uh, direct you to some articles that will show you how to, to do those parts of it but for now we'll, we will just transfer the actual files and it used to be that you had to have like an external hard drive or find some other way of transferring files but now with iTunes 9 home sharing you can transfer the actual files to it from one computer one computer to another as long as they're on the same network so first thing you're gonna need is you're gonna need to be on iTunes 9 on both computers and if you want to know what version you're on, on a Macintosh, you can go to the iTunes menu about iTunes. You'll see that I'm on iTunes 9, and on a Windows machine, it'll be under the help menu somewhere. So if you're not on iTunes 9, make sure you go download the new version and make sure you're up to date. Next thing you're going to want to do is make sure that your iTunes library is nice and organized. This is going to be even more important if you are going to be taking that extra step and transferring song ratings and playlists uh, uh, and some of the other resources that I'm going to link to. Um, and to do this, you are going to have to go into iTunes Preferences. And under Advanced, you want this Keep iTunes Media Folder Organized checked and Copy Files to iTunes Media Folder when adding to Library checked. I will press OK now. Next thing you're going to want to do is consolidate library. That is under File, Library, Organize Library. You're going to click on Consolidate Files. And if this is available to you, upgrade to iTunes Media Organization, then choose that as well. That is a, a new file structure in, that is uh, pretty recent in iTunes. Um, and press OK, and iTunes will go ahead and move all of those music files so that they're in properly organized folders. So next thing you're going to want to do after you're done with that is actually turn on the home sharing. So that will be over here on the left hand side and you'll have to put in your iTunes store account login and password, uh, the same one on both computers. So I'm going to go ahead and, and turn on home sharing on this computer. I'm going to turn on home sharing on my new computer and I'll meet you over at my new computer where I'll be transferring my music over. Okay, so here I am on my new computer. You can see I have no music on here at all. So what I'm going to do is turn on home sharing on my old computer. And there it is. Now I can browse freely my library from my old computer. I can even browse playlists. Now, if I wanted to transfer any of my individual playlists, I certainly could. However, then when I try to transfer the actual music, I would end up with duplicates. So what I'm going to do instead is just transfer the whole music library, just select all, and drag it on over to music, and it will begin transferring. Now, if I really do want to keep those playlists, I really do want to keep those play counts or my song ratings, there are some options available. I'll go ahead and link to those resources uh, in the description of this video. Um, but for now, I'm just transferring those songs over. So hopefully this will help you with getting songs over to your new computer using iTunes Home Sharing.